Afternoon. Everybody there. Oh, my micro. Always familiar faces. And with that, the moose took about a half hour with the Edmonton media assembled this afternoon to tell of life in the Big Apple and his feelings leading up to tonight's game. Last night before yesterday's game, I woke up about 2.30 and I couldn't sleep and I was really kind of nervous before last night's game. For whatever reason, I don't know, I guess uh, it was just instinct coming to Calgary that you had those uh, kind of <laughs> kind of uh, j uh, nervous jitters. But uh, And uh, I woke up again early this morning and uh, I certainly have the butterflies going right now. And Today was the first chance most of the Edmonton media have had a chance to talk to Messier since the October 4th trade. The trade, Messier says, he asked for in mid-July. Saying is a change as good as rest. Well, I think in my case, it's really true. Uh, um, I just think it was really time to move on and tackle something different and um, in a different environment, a different division, a different uh, teammates, a uh, different city and everything. And, you know, I've lived here uh, my whole life for 30, 30 years and... Uh, and uh, I just think that uh, really I felt in my heart in that time it was just the best for both myself and, and uh, the team. Now whether it was a good deal for both clubs only time will tell, but certainly so far it's been a great deal for Mark Messier. By the way, the Moose arrived in the building about 4.15 this afternoon, and we'll have more on tonight's game coming up in sports when we speak to another former Oiler now wearing Ranger colors, Adam Graves. Harry?